Down here, Greg. Whoa, a flamethrower. That's wild. Nah, it's just a thing to get rid of the weeds. It seems a bit extreme, my man. You're going full metal jacket back here. <laughs> oh, I'm just, I'm not used to the thistles you guys have out here. They're way more aggressive in Chicago. I can thank Big Pesticide for that. Come again now? Yeah, uh, I can't say the names. Too many birds around, but they engineered them to grow bigger out here. Uh, I think I can take the blame on this one. I've been so focused on work lately, they've kind of overtaken the yard. I see what you're laying down. What? The thistle situation. It's a metaphor for life. I'm just killing weeds here, Greg. Or an allegory? I, I get the two confused. Allegories are more like stories. It's an allegory. Keep it in mind, I really need to get back to this. I don't have a lot of time. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Um, I got your food, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, you just leave it on the recycling bin. No problemo. You know, we get so focused on work sometimes, we just forget that life keeps happening even when we're not paying attention. And when we do finally get a moment to check back in on the world, we got a bunch of shit to clean up. So in the hopes of saving time, we look for shortcuts. And sometimes they work, sometimes they create their own messes. We end up in a vicious cycle trying to keep up with the demands of life and cleaning up the messes we create with the shortcuts. We're not making a mess. This isn't a shortcut. This is a really effective way to get the roots. All right, how about this? Maybe it's a metallogory for your ADHD. Greg, I, I have a lot of yard work to do today. Well, you've always struggled with maintenance, exercise, relationships, hygiene, you know, the stuff to keep the lights on. It's just, it's not your thing. You like to do things where you see big results. You'd rather the weeds storm your yard like the beaches of Normandy and reenact the Korean War instead of pulling weeds a few times a week because pulling weeds doesn't give you that big dopamine dump. And deep down where you hold your deepest, darkest fears and secrets, like at 34, how every night you still worry you're going to wet the bed because you did until you were 12. And there, in your chamber of secrets, you wonder if Mrs. Popovich is correct and you did put more energy into chasing her instead of keeping the marriage alive. I'll leave those there. I was way off with the ADHD thing. That's what he gets for taking shortcuts.